What a nice night. It really is. Beautiful out here. Let's go to Dwayne Reed. What's up with your hair? It's flying in the wind. You got crazy hair. You know what I don't have on me? A charger for this camera. That is not good news. No, no, no. So they're filming something here tonight. I don't know what it is. Some kind of movie, maybe? I don't know. But um, it's a big deal. This is like the third set of whatever it is, because it said set one, set two, and set three. So I don't know. What did you need to get here? Makeup remover wipes. Nothing like, uh... oh boy, we'll be here a while. Whoa, look how many Lars there are. It's like a thousand of you, and I can't see all of you. Mm. Is there a better sight in the morning? I don't think there is. Oh yeah, don't don't overdo it with the sugar yet. Gotta keep your brother figure. Gotta keep my, my lady figure. <laughs> Alright, so, first day went phenomenal. The little one over here, she did a great job. She's laying down. We're gonna go take a walk. I want to show you guys something really cool. But in the meantime, here's something else that's really cool. We got the poster. It's coming home with us. We didn't have room in the car the night of the event, so now we have room, and we're taking her home. Taking you guys. It's all you guys. All the love from all of you from the book launch party. Thank you, everybody who tuned in. Everybody who came there. If you didn't watch it, you can still watch the live broadcast that was recorded. It's warm out today. It's one of those days where earlier today it was cool, cool if you were in the shade and you put your coat on and then you went into the sun and you froze. But now. It's a perfecto. How would Sal say that? So what I want to show you guys and Lara is the High Line Park. I might be calling it the wrong name, but I'm pretty sure that's what it's called. It's that bridge right up, not this one right here, but farther down there. It used to be a train bridge. It was a freight train bridge. I show you. It's pretty cool. So this is the old rails that ran when there were trains up here. And this is, what, 14th Street? Nice. Isn't that cool? And the whole way down you can stop. Actually it says right here what this is. Yeah, West 14th. It's pretty cool. Love is the answer, according to Einstein. What are your thoughts on that? I think he's very smart. He is. I think he's very smart. And he's very smart. What is this? Yes, this is because this is closed off. They're trying to, um, but be careful, don't trip over it. Trying to grow the grass back. Oh, wait, then let me fix it. Oh, look, look, the cute little mouse. Oh, gone. Here he comes. He's so cute. Uh, yeah, I think you have a different opinion of cute than most people around here. There's seriously mice everywhere, look. Oh, it's a little bit, uh, chubbier. He's... Like carbs. Yeah. <laughs> so, we're not going to get anything big because Lara's been bite tasting all day. And um, so have I. Oh, yeah, that's right. You have a fitting, a makeup, and hair thing. And fun fact Rana catered Lara's book launch party. Yeah. They did a fantastic job. Escarole salad times two. And we're going to share the bronzino, right? No, the chicken. Where was I? Where have I been? What a beauty. So this is this is different than the last time we got it. This is over, what is that, Radipio and am I, is that my right? Oh wow. That's interesting. What's that? The dressing? That's like fennel puree dinner or something. Ooh, 
that sounds lovely. I think you need to make this for me when I go home. Oh, yeah. All right, it's my understanding there's a Mrs. Vitali Brownie in here somewhere. No. Is that it right here? No. I'm not going to even show what she's doing right now. Cutting open a passion fruit with a butter knife. Nope, it is a sharp knife that I bought. Is this the brownie? It looks like a brownie. There's also some lasagna in here. What do you think of all the Halloween decorations in here? Here, how about this one up here? Watch, there's one that swings. How about this guy, look. I don't like it. Oh, I don't like it. No? Not a Halloween fan? Another great day. Laura has a hair and makeup trial coming up in a little bit here, in like a half hour. So I have no makeup on. Don't look at time me. to go get a coffee. And get her back in there. But look at this weather. 72 degrees, sunny. This is like perfection. We should just move here. Look up. <laughs> I know you love clowns. I don't like Halloween scary I like kids. You like pumpkins non-scariness. Mums. Mums are nice. Huh? I don't like scary things. So let's see what else they have here. Enter at your own risk. Lots of bats. Yesterday, it was so cold here. In the morning, it just smelled like Christmas. Well, I wanted to take everybody for a Halloween tour of what they have going on here. There's the flowers from the other day. Got some ghosts. Look at this one. Look at that. See, the fan is off, but when the fan is on, all the well, the it blows in the wind. Well, that's just an elevator. Relax. Look at the big spider. That's where we get our coffee. Amy's bread. Well, sometimes Starbucks. Oh, you know, Laura's been hanging out with some awesome foodies this week. I have. Um, my heaven. Skinny Taste was up there the other day. Oh, yep. Gina Hamolka was up there the other day. Make sure you check her out. Look her up. She's um, great. She's real sweet and she's so cute and talented and real. I like her a lot. I like her a lot. The baby? Oh, yeah. Found her pear juice. I have eight cup too. Ooh, let me get you a basket. That's Nana's stuff right there. Yeah. The little toasted um, bread things. I love these with some um, tuna. Tuna and tomato. Mm hmm. It's just whole grain, yeah. All kinds of cheeses from all over the place. What? Where's the. We should check and see if they have the sardines. They do. We'll get some tomorrow. That's right. Is that a jar of broccoli rob? Yeah. That's cool. What is that? What is it like marinated it's in? Marinated um, rob. Is that a succulent? Is that that one that you can eat? It looks like it. So cool. I don't know what that is. Yeah, salad something or other. <laughs> Should get the artichokes and the broccoli rob. I'm interested in that. Yeah, I'm gonna try that tomorrow. I'm gonna come up tomorrow because we'll be there tomorrow. All right, so last night we took you guys down the north side of Pilot Highline Park. Oh, there she is. So this is pretty cool. They put this, this is like bleachers, and you can sit here and watch the traffic on, I think this is 10th Avenue. Check this out. You know, in case that's, in case you want to watch the traffic. So you can just sit right here and watch the cars come out from underneath of you and pass some time. No, nope, the light turned green, so I expect some cars. Pretty cool, huh? So when this used to be the train bridge, that's the rails from the train right there. It used to run, I guess there were two sets of rails, one on the left, one on the right, because it's pretty wide up here. Last day, there I'm she so is. so sad. She's so sad. You know what's happening right now? What's that? That meme that says, you smile and pretend all is well with the world. Meanwhile, deep in your boot, your sock is falling off. It's true. And it's driving is it? Crazy. All right, finally home, sweet home. I gotta get a haircut, so don't look over here. Uh, missed my opportunity this week. Laura, I got a package here. This thing's huge. I don't know what's going on here. It's a big box. It's, it's called my a ghost, ghost chair. chair. I don't even know what that is. Room. It's uh, yes. I guess it's a ghost chair because it's clear. Yes. 
Yes! It's a very nice chair. Isn't that pretty? But what's with the cover? It came separately. I'm gonna do it like this. And I cut the sticker off, of course. And do it like that. Oh, I see. Why, why would, oh, I get what you're saying. Okay, so it's like oh, nice and padded. Wow. That's nice. How are you doing? It's nice, isn't it? All right, anyhow, I had the mode, the camera mode was wrong. So anyway, we're back. We're yeah. back home for a little bit. Um, Laura had a fabulous time. The best With time some fabulous ever. peers of hers in the uh, industry. Great time. And um, soon we'll be telling you all about it, trust me. It's just that uh, we will when the time comes. We have rules we have to follow. And that's all I'm going to say about that. But we have a lot of uh, exciting stuff but coming up in the next couple I'll weeks. I'll give you a hint. It's simply marvelous. Nice. nice. <laughs> but anyway, today's our anniversary! Six years. Six years of wedded bliss. Yes. How do you feel about that? I feel fantastic about it. It's been the best six years of my life by yeah. far. I've never thought Why is that my. So gigantic. Never thought it could be this fun to be married. I never thought that in a million years. Thank you for making it such a fun time for me and no. for us. And we've had such a great, fabulous time. Yeah. So we have to run out to Target real quick. And I don't know what I'm going to do. I've got to get rid of this big giant box. I would get in it, but there could be spiders. And no, no, no spiders. No well, spiders. but it could totally fit in your watch. We're looking for shelves. You know what I'm talking about? I do. I know what you're talking about, but I don't understand why there's a roll of bagels over here. There's a lot of stuff that shouldn't be over here. People just take stuff off their cards. They put it wherever. Yeah, I don't know. This seems like a smaller section than usual. No, but if they did used to be here, they used to be all the way down there, but now they're not anywhere. Hmm. Maybe because it's seasonal time and they put all the holiday stuff out. But they have Christmas stuff. Lots of it. High chair shopping, folks. That's what we're doing. Not for me. It's for a little uh, baby Papa Giorgio and Big Man. And we got little Bobby. We got a lot of babies we got to put in the high chairs. We, um, we have a lot of babies around. Are not pregnant? I tell you how was. Well, we're just very prepared. You never know. Uh, no, it's uh, when, when Jamie and Kate and everybody comes over with the babies and they're sitting eating dinner, they're holding the baby. Yeah, they have to put them in the makes sense. So I want to get a, a high chair just to have at home. Can cool. we get this too? This is nice. We'll put this in the back of our car. Is it wood? I don't know. We got the Mutaloons. And I got a Chromecast box from Google. See that? We went away for the week. We came back. We had gifts. Let's see what's in here. Is Chromecast like a printer? That's a little, little note. No, it's so you can broadcast video from your phone to your TV. They sent a Chromecast for like the new version. And my sister-in-law thought these were bowling balls. They're not. And um, Chromecast audio. So let's see what this is all about. All right, so I think these just came out like a couple days ago, but I don't know. And we already have several of the regular Chromecasts on our TV so we can push video to them. And that's what this is, the new version. One of the things I guess that was a problem for a lot of people was that the old one was like a big brick and it wouldn't fit. Well, that's cool, look, it's magnetic. So this way it fits no matter what, right? Whatever your configuration is, you just plug it in and it kind of dangles off the side. And then if you want to take it with you, boop, it's very convenient. And power cord in case your TV doesn't have USB, but a lot of TVs you can just plug that in the USB port on the back. Bada bing. Yeah, a lot of TVs have it, so you can put like pictures up there and do like a slideshow. That's cool. And then Chromecast audio. What is going on over there? Jeez Louise. This one is new. Feels kind of heavy. Um, has a little power button. Uh, I have no idea. I should probably read the instructions. Uh, maybe if you hook it to a speaker, it would make noise when you push the button. But that's Jada's book. It's not even out yet. It comes out November 3rd. Can't Make sure wait. you check it out. Jada De Laurentiis. Gorgeous. It's her new cookbook. It's gorgeous. This is her eighth cookbook. Wow. Wow, that's, that's a lot. wonderful. I have zero cookbooks. That's pretty impressive. So this is... Basically, you take that thing, you plug it into a speaker, and you can push music to your speakers wirelessly from Ooh. your phone. Except I don't really Or from your computer. Watch. Okay, nobody's, nobody's excited about this. Okay, cool. This is the best pair of nectar in the entire world. And I, I used to drink, they, they come in like little cartons as well. I got these at the little Italian store in Chelsea Market. I was gonna go back and get other stuff, but I didn't have a chance to. They come in little cartons too, but I used to drink them in the glass bottle, so I always buy them in the glass bottle and you just sort of shake it, shake it, shake it and it's so good. I'm just gonna have another one now. Why is it, why wouldn't it focus? They have peach, apricot, but pear is my favorite. And then I got this tuna, which is actually a new Italian brand. I've never actually tried this before. Um, so we'll see. Should be yummy. 
should be good. And then these, which I don't have any left over from Italy, but basically you soak these little babies with some water and then you drizzle a little bit of olive oil. You can top them with whatever you want. And I top them with tuna that's mixed with like tomatoes and olives and things like that. So it's really, really good for a nice lunch or a light dinner. And then I got these vegetable bouillon cubes because I never tried this brand before. So I'm excited to try that. And some chocolate eggs. These are not Kinder, but these remind me of my great grandmother when she used to have a little uh, glass bowl in her kitchen with little chocolate egg eggs and candy. So I got that. They're, to be honest, not the best I've ever had. But they taste like, I don't know, they taste weird. Am I right? I don't know why this is not in focus. There you go. Yeah, they taste like. Yeah, it's not. I don't know. It's bizarre. All right. I got nothing. I'm gonna get this video up there. I'm gonna go upload this vlog. We're gonna have some uh, pasta in a few minutes here from Laura Vitale herself. What is this? Nice little pumpkin. Mm-hmm. What are you putting in there? I got it at Francesca's. Like the little. Oh yeah, you should put pumpkin spice inside in there. Inside. Thankful. It's Isn't very it sweet. It's a little more fresh. I think I'm gonna put this in my makeup room and store like my little studs or something on my desk. That'd be cute. It'll Which, be very by cute. Way, I'm actually gonna go. Over. Gonna go up. Upload this video, and we'll see you guys next time. That's cool. Look, they have like a market hall with food in there, like a little little food court section. It's neat. It's like an outside mall. It's really nice.